Let's say you're better game nine than you were game one, because you're pretty young at this position yeah. still. Um, truthfully, I say, like Coop was talking about, like the approach. Um, game one, because we're coming off fall camp, everything was just, it was coming easier. And as the weeks were going on, everybody started to get better themselves. And I feel like that was something that I had to, I, I had talks about with Coop and, and Bray, just my approach to practice had to be way different. Um, every, every practice day had to be like a game. So, I, so every day was a game for me. Um, so I feel like that was probably the biggest yeah. thing. Did your week look a little different like this week than it did say week one of the week, week one or two? Yeah, most definitely like watching way more film than I was, um, asking more questions, stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. How, how do you, how do you feel like this season's going? What, how are you feeling about the season? I feel like everybody, including myself, has a lot of development to still do. And I feel like we're still working together through that. Um, but I mean, it's not going amazing, but it's not going bad either. We're, we're doing, we're doing what we're, we're supposed to be doing. We just have to keep doing that day in and day out. Yeah. This, this is the time of year when, you know, some teams would be on a three game losing streak, not yeah. many games left, start checking out, looking at the transfer portal. What, what keeps this team together? Coach Bray talks about it um, almost every day. Um, the, like the three or four fights you fight every day. And it's the media telling you how good or bad you are. Because if you're doing amazing, they're going to tell you how good you are. If you're doing bad, they're going to tell you how bad you're doing. And how, oh, he missed this tackle, blah, blah, blah. And the biggest one was division within. And we're trying to make sure that everybody is, we're still on the same page. We, we're 0-0 right now. This is, we're the last four games of the season. That's all we're worried about. Everything that happened before happened. We can't change that. If you could get better at one thing between now and the end of the season, what, what, what would you like that to be? Decision making. I think just trusting what I see and not, not second guessing it. Was that a little bit of, was that the main thing? Sounds like that was the main thing that surprised you more than the physicality is just the complexity of the game at this level? Yeah, I think last year I definitely peeked into that just a little bit, but without, Having a whole bunch of game experience, I just wasn't able to see that. I mean, practice is only going to give you so much. And, but this year, definitely, I feel like decision making. Because I mean, I have some of the stuff I just haven't seen before. And me just trusting that and just going faster. And when I see it, just, just go. That was, pretty, that was probably the biggest thing for me. When you talk about managing the division from within, is that focusing, making sure more of your focus is on football? Or is that spending more time with your teammates and and you know, just trying to give each other a reason to, to not want to go anywhere? I think it's both. I think we all have to have the same goal. We're all trying to win. And that's, I mean, whatever happens, happens. But that's what we're here for. We're trying to win. And just trying to make sure that, I mean, OK, this, this guy didn't play this great this game. We still got you. Like, it's un unwavering faith. That's what we're trying to preach right now. And, we we don't not believe in you because you missed a tackle. That that's not a thing here. Um, so yeah. Being uh, two wins away from bowl eligibility, was there any extra like, just any extra pressure to get the win at home this week before having to go play some tougher games on the road? I don't think that that's something that we've really been focused on. I mean, it's we we're just worried about the next game. So when we play this game, we're worried about the next game after that. We're not we don't want to look too far in the future because we're going to miss the present. Um, so yeah. What do you see from San Jose State when you look at their offense? I mean, they're pretty good. Um, they can throw the ball really well. They get the ball out really quick. They can run the ball. They have two pretty good backs. Um, so it, it'll be game. Anything else? All right. Perfect. Thanks, Thanks All right. Thank you.